the teams here at the Wacker. The Sharks on six points. The Eels only on two. The Sharks have to win. Gavin Miller knows that they've got to keep their semi-final lives a hopes here in Western Australia. They've got to look to the likes of that man, McGaw, and of course, Eddinghausen. They've got to get involved. They've got to lay on the play out wide for Cronulla. And here comes Parramatta. Drake is leading them out, but he's not the captain tonight. And here comes Parramatta. The habit is always for Brett Kenny, their skipper. He likes to be last one out on the field. And he will walk on. He's in no rush. But when he gets the ball, the defence is always in a rush to try and stop him. Kenny, last man out. The skipper with the job to try and help some young men with experience in rugby league. Starting to get their bearings, both these sides. Also, Eddie Ward, the referee for this Nissan Friday nighter. Davidson got hammered by Johnston. He hurt Diamond, and Davidson, bravely back to his feet, a great head on. Wayne Pierce, those head on tackles by Peter Johnson, they create much more damage than does the shoulder charge and they, they certainly are, to my mind, much more about what forward play is all about. Oh, that's for sure. I mean, psychologically it gives the, the, the Parramatta side a big lift. If you see one of your teammates make a massive hit like that, it really does lift you high up off, off the ground. But Craig Diamond and Les Davidson, if they're going to run towards Peter Johnson, they'll have to put a What clever on. play! Eddinghausen! Brilliant stuff! We're waiting for something to give here at the Wacker. Kenny, they're finding some holes. Here goes Bell. He'll have to take on McKellar. He beats him. McKellar off balance and, and Parramatta. They've come across to the West Coast and they've set the Wacker alight. Quick play the ball. McGaw's there. Healy. Lined out wide to the right. The defence stands back and waits. Healy trying to punish them. Inside, McKellar! McKellar had it, Eddinghausen unmarked, he would have scored under the post. Kenny. The call from the defence here saying that he will back. This man's ducking nothing! Ericsson, Ericsson beats the fullback. In and away, Parramatta. Every time they get tested at the other end, they come back to lay one on themselves. The posts aren't far away. Healy, Speechley, Speechley through the dummy, Speechley! They get it, they climb back. Plenty of headaches for Alan Fitzgibbon and the uh, Cronulla side. We're in injury time now, there's been a fair bit of it. Two Parramatta players have gone to the head bend. There's full time at the Wacker. 24 points. 22 points to 12 in favour of the Eels over the Cronulla Sharks who came here with a lot to play for but are going to go home with nothing to show for it. A fantastic game here once again at the Wacker and anyone who saw this game would have to be uh, have to be pleased with the way the, the, the game was played, the spirit in which it was played and the open foot.